YouTube, what's up? I'm back with another one, baby. So what we got going on today is tail lights. If you read the, there we go. Read the title. We're doing tail lights. We got the Aventador tail lights. And we putting on the, the white Batmobile. That's what I call it. Somebody else gave it the name, but I'm like, the white Batmobile. It's all right. I might keep that name. I might not. All right. So what we doing here? Pretty easy, man. Um, first time working on the Chevy. I'm usually working on Dodges, but it's all pretty much still the same shit. Push pins and clips and plug and play aftermarket parts. So you're going to be taking this piece off, this piece off, and this piece off. And then mine, obviously, is already gone. Must have been like that already. And it's going to pull that back. Let's go expose that piece. You got a little bolt right here you got to unscrew. Uh, it looked like probably about a, I don't know, maybe eight millimeter or something. Don't mark, don't, don't, uh, take my word for it, but a small little boat. That one missing, so somebody already been doing some lights and doing some work on this shit. So, so as you can see, I got all three of the little push pin rivets out. So we usually go take that off. And I'm gonna set this to the ground. Set this on the ground, put the rivets right on top. Now, so you got that exposed. Now you just gotta push back that carpet. Yeah. And then, like I said, that bolt is missing. And this one, we just gotta get rid of that one. And I'm not gonna be able to do it with my hand, so we just gotta take that off. Anyway, you gonna take the three nuts off. They eight millimeters, so you got one, two, and then you pull the carpet back, and there's one right there. You take that off. I already took them off. So now, we just gotta give the light a tug. A nice little tug like that. I just popped out. And we gonna be able to get this out, all right? Be right back when I get this off. Once you get the bolts out, um, all you do is give this a nice, give this nice, give this light <laughs> a nice tug, and then you're gonna detach the harness right here. You go detach that harness from that, and then you just go take this off, move to the side. And then we got the new one right here in the trunk. And we just go put that back in place. But with these, if you want, they sequential. And if you want them sequential, you want to unplug. I'm sorry, I'm trying to move this camera around. It's terrible. My bad, y'all. I'm going to get better. You're going to unplug this. See that? That purple or red or whatever? That purple purple and orange wire? You want to unplug that if you want it sequential. If you don't want it sequential, then you're going to leave that plugged in. But I want them sequential, so I'm going to unplug it. You'll see what I'm talking about. So this is what they look like when you're in a running position. That's the factory. This is the aftermarket. So I'm gonna have to start the car up to do my blinkers so you can see the sequential motion. So be right back. I am cammed out, sorry for the noise. That's the sequential. And then I did earlier in the video, I said you had to unplug the wires, leave the wires plugged up, that purple and that orange one, because that's gonna access the sequential. Don't unplug them. Don't unplug them. There you go. Have one. One more to go. This side. Take them three push pins off. Pull the carpet back, and you got your three nuts. And like I was saying on the last, in the last video, um, you leave this wire, this purple and orange wire. You leave that wire connected if you want it sequential. If you don't want it sequential, you unplug it. So basically, the sequential is the you know the arrow that pop 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 pop. But if you just want it to all blink at the same time, you unplug it. But if you want the sequential, the pop, 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 then leave it plugged up, all right? So then you just go put this back in place, and then I'm gonna show you the after. 